What's going on peeps? Welcome back to another episode. I hope you're all doing well. Today is Sunday and I'm gonna be working on delivery only tonight and I'm gonna be doing it on my e-bike. This is the Himiway Zebra. I've set it up to be my delivery bike and I've got a 20 amp hour battery in here and I wanna see how many miles and most importantly, how much money I can make on one single charge. I'm not gonna be going home or I'm not gonna be finishing my delivery shift until this bike dies completely. I have added some accessories. I've got my lock from hip lock. I've got my phone mount from mouse case and my GoPro mount. And obviously the main thing that I need is my delivery bag. So there is a little bit of added extra weight on the odometer here. I've got 406.8 kilometers. So when the bike is near enough to completely die in, I'll be able to see how many miles I've done. I could run, run Strava in the background, but I don't want my phone to die when I'm doing deliveries. I have got a power bank, but but yeah, I don't, I don't really find Strava to be that accurate. Obviously, this has got its own built-in controller, so it'll be able to tell me how many, how many miles I'm doing. Enough waffling, let's get straight into it. Go online with Deliveroo and get the first order. Oh, and I forgot to add, I'm also gonna be riding the bike in level assist four and five only, which are the most assist that this bike gives. I think a range test should be done on the highest assist mode, because yeah, who delivers food in level assist one or two? No one. I'll bring you back as soon as the first one's in. Go and uh, see what we can do and how much we can earn. There we go. So I just made my way up to Vauxhall and the first order's in there. £5.35. Oh, it was one single drop. Now it's turned into a double. Okay, that's cool. I'll take that. Hopefully it's paying more than £5.35 now. Oh yeah, £7.50. There we go. By the old days, they've ordered 20 chicken wings. One of the customers. Let's go get it. Just got to get across this road and lock up the bike and go inside Nando's. This pickup it's quite weird actually. You don't actually go inside the restaurant. They, you have, they make you go under the underpass over there, which I hate doing. But this is why I don't like going under here. Imagine a car loses control and like crashes. You've got nowhere to run. See, people do drive nuts down here. I've got uh, that one there and then there's another one, 5286. That's oh, right, I'll just take that one. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not going to wait around. Might as well take the one that's ready because that one's just going to be sitting there getting cold. All right, the first one, four minutes away, 0.8 miles. I don't think I mentioned the time as well, people. I started my shift at 10 past six, I think it was. Oh, that Velcro has not weakened one bit. <laughs> I thought it'd weaken after like using it, but it's just so strong. I mean, it's a good thing because it keeps the, the bag sealed. Yeah, I've never had Velcro that strong before. Let's go get this one done. Super close, got her in no time. High delivery. Oh yeah, you're probably wondering. London Eats, why are you not wearing a helmet? Basically, I presented a video for Electro Heads. This one here, I'll pop it up on the screen. And in one of the shots, I had to remove my helmet. And yeah, I left it in the park. Oh yeah, thank you. Can I get your delivery code? Thank you. All right, that's the first one done. Five pound 35, first job. Whilst I'm waiting for my next order to come in, I just want to thank today's video sponsor, Manscaped. Manscaped is trusted by more than 9 million men worldwide for their trimmers, liquid formulations, and premium boxes. And their performance package 4.0 is a game changer when it comes to creating the ultimate grooming and men's hygiene bundle. First to highlight is the Lawnmower 4.0. This is their fourth generation electric trimmer that features a cutting edge ceramic blade designed to reduce grooming accidents and has a 4000K LED spotlight for when you need a more precise shave. Because this trimmer is waterproof, you can also trim in the shower and finally say goodbye to the mess on the bathroom floor. The Lawn Mower 4.0 trimmer also features a smart cordless charging system. Tap on the button three times and this will enable the travel lock feature. The Performance Package 4.0 also includes the new Weed Whacker 2.0 nose and ear hair trimmer. The Weed Whacker 2.0 is cordless, rechargeable and has a battery of up to 45 minutes of runtime. Also included in the Performance Package 4.0 kit are two products, the Crop Preserver Ball Deodorant, yes that's deodorant for your balls, and the Crop Reviver Ball Toner Spray. Manscaped even threw in two free gifts with their Performance Package 4.0, the Manscaped Anti-Shave boxes and the shed travel bag. Go to Manscaped today and get 20% off and free international shipping when you use my code LONDONEATS. Now let's get back 
to doing some deliveries. Yeah, I was very nervous in that video shoot. Go and check it out. It was for a bike review, ADO Beast. And it's a really, really good bike. Oh, and that brings me on to say about e-bikes, Hemiway got in touch with me and they was very impressed on how I set this bike up to be a delivery bike. And they said that they sell a cargo, which is called the Big Dog, which I wish they sent me that one in the beginning because they sent me the Zebra. They are the same spec bike. They have the same motor and same battery, but the actual layout of the bike is completely different. It's more of a step through design and the rear rack is a lot bigger. So yeah, they've agreed to send me one out so I can review it. I just wish, I wish I knew about that bike beforehand. All right, I'm gonna head back up to Delivery Editions. Not Delivery Editions, Delivery Hot and the dark kitchen that I normally go to. Still on five bars and yeah, 410.9 kilometers on the clock. I'm gonna be really interested to see how many miles I can actually do on this bike. <laughs> Fast forward into this video, it's like 2 a.m. and I'm still struggling to get this bike to die. <laughs> oh, it's very warm. Currently 25 degrees, that's why I'm out in a t-shirt. Got a jacket in my bag as well, just in case it gets a little bit cold later on. No doubt it will. It'll probably end up raining. No in England. There's another one, it's a double. The second customer is very far, so I am gonna accept it. Seven minutes away, no, two minutes away. All right, thank you, thanks. All right then, so first one is 1.9 miles away. And then the one after that, I think is gonna be about two miles. I had to wait a little bit of time for that order, but got there in the end. Let's get on the road and get this first one dropped off. Jesus Christ, not allowed to turn left there, I'm sure you're not. Oh, that was the end of, uh, end of me. <laughs> that guy in front was like, you old You tell him, you tell him. All right, just arrived at my customer's location and there's a two pound tip included as well. Cheers. Hello. 9187, that one is yours. Cheers, can I get you a delivery code? Cheers, thank you. All right, straight on to the next one, which is, oh, it's only 2.1 miles. I thought it was way further than that. 2.1's okay. Be there in no time. That's the thing, the cycle, or Google Maps gives you the cycle route and it says a certain time, but that's not for e-bikes. That's for just normal bicycles. And obviously e-bikes go a lot faster than most bicycles out there, unless you're one of those fixie riders and you can reach speeds of like 40 miles an hour. Let's go get the next one done. Keep it on a roll. Still on full battery. No bars have gone down yet. How you doing, man? Nice one, bro. Oh my God, what a legend. When I hear someone shout the channel name, it just motivates me so much. Damn. That sun is sunning right now. So bright. <laughs> you probably can't even see anything on this GoPro. I oh, know, it looks quite cool actually. About to go down some crazy hill. Let's see what sort of speed I can get. Oh my God. I'm on the highest gear now as well. 44, 46, 48 kilometers an hour. Come on, let's get to 60. 55, Woo! 55 kilometers. Oh my God. Who said flat tire e-bikes weren't fast? Bloody flying. Just arriving to, what's this, the third customer of the evening? Three pound tip included in this one. Hey, thank you very much. Thank you. Can I get your code oh, as well? 96. 96. Thanks for your tip. Appreciate it. Five pound in tips so far. Only across, what, three orders? Takes me up to 23 pound and 58 pence. And I've been online for an hour. That is good going. Hopefully it continues like that. Imagine if I make 23 pound an hour, every hour. See, I don't know what it is. When I go out on my new, I can make good money. I can make 20 pound an hour or more, but it is like rushing around and working as fast as possible. And then I come out on my e-bike and it's just, it's just easy. I don't know, I don't know, it's, it's a weird one. It's like if I don't think about it and put too much thought into making the money and just picking up and delivering, the money just follows. I don't know, it's a weird, it's a weird, and I don't really like saying that. Say, you know, yeah, the money follows but it's true. I'm just chilling out. I'm not trying to make as much money as possible tonight. Obviously the whole reason of this video is to see how much uh, this bike can, how fast it, how fast, how far it can go before it dies. And I'll bring you back when the next one's in, which is right now. Accept that and head down to the restaurant, which is two minutes away. Let's head over to Village Tandoori. How much is it paying? I don't know until I get there. I think it was five pound. Keep your hands on the handlebars. It's a habit. Very irresponsible, London Eats. Seven pound 14 for this order. Hello, mate. Oh, it's hot in here. 9837, yeah. Thank you. 
Right, we're going over to Brixton, 2.6 miles. It's like a sauna in there. Boiling. Yeah, by the way, people, this bike has got a throttle, but it doesn't do anything. Well, it does. It enables me to get the bike off the line. It's not an actual throttle. So look, if I hold it, nothing happens. Nothing at all. Like, I don't, I don't go nowhere. Look, just to prove it, I'll pull over and put the bike on the kickstand with the back wheel off the floor. And if I pull the throttle, it goes six kilometers. That's literally like a walk assist. And I think the law around throttles on e-bikes is that is the limit. I think six kilometers per hour is the limit. Oh, you're joking, man. Look at all that glass. Luckily, I saw that before I put the bike fully on it. Would be my luck to get a puncher on a range test video, wouldn't it? Hey, uh, can I get your delivery code, please? Thank you. Done. Pow. Still not gotten, gone down any bars on the bike yet. Still on five bars, up to 424 kilometers. I can't even remember what I started on. But yeah, total earning so far, 30 pound. And I've been working for just over an hour. All good, yeah? yeah Cheers, mate. Got the red balls. Yeah, baby. And I have my uh, watermelon and then uh, carry on. Yeah, I actually left my zone as well earlier on. Well, on that delivery. So I'm just creeping back in so I can go back online. It's going well so far and the time is only 7.30. I'm wondering how long this episode is going to be. I'm just thinking in terms of this battery. Is it, am I going to be out here still at 3 a.m.? In the bin. I've got it in the bin. Yes. There's another double, £7.25, and it's uh, pretty close to each other. They just gave me another one, but it was going miles away. Oh, I was going to leave the bike here like this. Oh my God, I'm so stupid. <laughs> I was just going to leave the bike there like I'm on the, on the new. Completely forgot that I had to lock it up. Yeah, apparently this place is taking uh, very long to hand out orders. But I'm going to go in there because you never know, my one might be ready straight away. Oh my God, what is going on in here? Yeah, this one is mine. Oh, this big order. This big order. Wait. Oh, can I put can I put this one in my bag to keep it warm? Yeah. It's Which this one? one? This, yeah. You know this. One? I'm just gonna put this in my bag now. Yeah, to keep it hot. Go for them, yeah. Cheers, man. I think I got kind of lucky there. That other guy was waiting for ages. Yeah, I picked up five mixed meze. So heavy. <laughs> a lot of food. See how far I'm going. Eight minutes. One point three miles. First customer's address. Hi, delivery. Hi there. Hi there. There's Thank one, and there's the other. Can Brilliant. I get your delivery code? Uh, 11. 11, perfect. Perfect. Thank, Thank you. So get on to the next customer, which is, oh, it's only three minutes away. 53, nice one. Thank you. Still on level assist five and still got five bars remaining. It was jumping between four bars and five bars, but that is due to voltage sag. A lot of people were asking in my Brighton episode, why was I saying that I had three bars of battery left? And then when I stopped, it went back up to four. Basically on e-bikes, when you're riding, there's a lot of voltage that is being drawn from the battery and being put into the motor. So it can obviously propel you forwards. And sometimes you get a thing called voltage sag. And that is when the controller gets confused and there's a little bit of a drop in voltage and yeah it displays the wrong information all right there's another order there i'm gonna take that six pound 44 all right let's go pick up this order there we go look you can see it's dropped down to four bars now but once i stop and stop using the uh, bike you'll see it jump back up to five bars once i stop here at these traffic lights it should jump back back up to five normally it does probably gonna show me up now i'll not do it ah uh, it's not doing it now Oh my God. There we go, look, see? It's up to five bars again. Whoa, this is quite a lot of food. How you doing, all right? A4 double three. Thank you. All right, instant pick up there. This one's going 10 minutes, 1.5 miles. How you doing, all right? 81, yeah? Thank you. Cheers, man. Oh, there's another one straight away. Cream's Cafe. All right, let's go pick up this order, which is 0.7 miles away. Straight away, another order. That's what we like. Yeah, I've dropped down to four bars now, but it should start going down. Not drastically, but it will start going down quite a bit because it takes so long for that first bar to go. And I think after the third one, it does go down quite a bit. Yeah, let's go pick up uh, this next order from a dessert shop. Time now is uh, 23 minutes past eight. So I've been working for two hours now. So I arrived at Creams. This one's turned into double. Hey, nine pound 35. See if it's ready. Oh, 
not waiting around no more. 10 minutes is the max for me. I am not waiting around. They don't know what they're doing in there. Yeah, no thanks. Let me go and get an order from somewhere else, somewhere that don't take the pit. Was telling drivers, yeah, cancel the order. Well, if you can't keep up with orders that are coming in, as well as the orders coming in, like the people in the restaurant, turn off the delivery tablet. See, it annoys me when companies do that. I understand everyone's got to make money, but we're losing out on money. We're waiting there, not getting paid. We don't get paid to stand around. And it's just, yeah, it's annoying. So far, 44 pound and 41 pence. Time now is 8.37. I'm down to four bars on the bike. Yeah, I'm gonna switch up the area. Yeah, I'll bring you back when the next order's in. There's another order there from Deliveroo Hot, £4.50. Let's go and get it. And I've just dropped down to three bars. I told you, once I hit that third bar, it drops very, very fast. So I've done 30 kilometers so far. I don't know what that is in miles. I need to work it out. Still got three bars to go. But I'm making good money. Let's see if my uh, favorite delivery employee is working. Oh, it's turned into a double. Thank you. That's on both. Got those orders. Let's see where the first one is. 12 minutes, 2.2 miles. Yeah, I had to wait a little bit of time for those orders, but I got there in the end. Good decision to cancel that creams order that I had earlier on. I knew something better was going to come in. Arrived to uh, the first drop. I'm not even going to risk it. I'm going to take my bike in. Hi, delivery. And I've got a one pound tip as well. Oh, yeah. I'll get your delivery code as well, please. Thank you. Take care. Okay, on to the next one. It's 0.4 miles away. Doing well for tips so far. I think I'm up to six pound. All right, I'm going to crack on with deliveries and I'll bring you back in about an hour. Kicking off, mate. Another day in London, kicking off. Uh, yeah, peeps, 20 past nine thought I'd bring you back a lot sooner than what I was going to. Um, I just had a creams order come in. Hopefully this one's a lot faster than the one I went to earlier on. Oh, are you hungry? You want some food? Order something, I'll get it for you. Yeah, go on, get it, get it, it's cool. Get a drink as well, make sure you get a drink for yourself as well. What milkshake do you want? Chocolate, vanilla, strawberry, is that what you want, yeah? yeah. Okay, cool. No, no, I deliver for delivery. So you allow for three meals? Or? No, 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 pay for I'm it. paying for this, yeah, man. It's cool, man, no worries. 3895, yeah? Thank you. Cheers, man. Look after yourself, yeah? Take care, man. No worries. Yeah, had to do my good deed for the day. I didn't really like the way that they was uh, shooing him off when he asked for something. I think this one is pretty close. Yeah, 1.1 miles. Five minutes it's going to take me. Can I get your code as well, please? Cheers. Thanks, man. All right, that's that delivery done. Time now is uh, 9.35. I'm just going to do some deliveries and then, yeah, I'll do two or three and then bring you back. But I'm currently on 444 kilometers. We've got three bars left. Going quite far. I'm going to take it. Let's go get it. Thank you, man. I'll be two seconds, eh? Ah, oh, see, that's why it's good to get to know other riders in areas that you work in. That guy said that he will look after my bike. And I trust him. I've known him for like four or five years. But yeah, this is a very far drop. It's going to uh, Battersea. It's going to be like four miles, maybe. Thank you. Thanks. Instant pickup. Let's see how far it is. Oh, 2.9 miles. I want far off. 17 minutes it's going to take me. I'm down to two bars on the bike. All right, just arrived at this customer's location and there's a three pound tip included in this uh, order. Wow, doing very, very good for tips tonight. It's, uh, it's quite unusual to get tips on deliveries here in England. Yeah, look at Battersea Power Station. I was there the other day. It's amazing what they've done inside there. I've got a delivery for flat 90. Oh, is it you? Oh, sh sorry. <laughs> Appreciate it. Could I get your delivery code? Oh, thanks for your tip as well, man. Can't forget to say thank you. All right, that one's done. Got quite a cycle back to where I was just now. And I am going to cycle back there. But if any jobs come in, obviously I'm going to take them. It is going well. What's the time now? Just gone 10 p.m. Four hours. I've been working. Oh, there we go. The bike has just dropped down to one bar. I'm going to take that. It's £5.50. And the customer is very, very close. £5.50 is quite good. Let's go and pick up this order from Lucky Cat. Thank you. All right, this one is only two minutes away, 0.3 miles. And with close orders, sometimes the customers tip because they know that delivery riders don't get paid a lot for the job. I mean, 550 is quite good, actually. I, I shouldn't really be saying that, but I, I do it anyway. I tip every single driver on the exception that they have a uh, uh, thermal bag. No thermal bag, no tip. Hi, hi, hi. Hi, yeah. 70, yeah. 
Perfect, thank you. Right. Take care. Bye. Bye. All right, so update, the time is 10 to 11. I'm down to one bar, but the bike is acting really, really weird. It's giving me a little bit of assistance. It's not giving me much now. It's that the motor cuts in and then cuts out again. But yeah, I'm gonna see if I can get another order before uh, before the bike dies. All right then, peeps, so update. The bike is still on one bar. However, I'm getting zero assist. I think I'm gonna call it the end to the shift because I'm getting no more assistance and trust me this bike weighs a ton all right and peeps i'm gonna finish up the episode there the time is 20 past well just approaching 20 past 11 so i've been working for five hours in total i made 76 pound and that was for nine deliveries in total done nine pound in tips one pound 20 in extra fees and 66 pound in order fees most importantly how many kilometers did i manage to do there is the total figure 469.4 i've just had a look i started on 406.8 62.6 kilometers in total 38.898 i'm just gonna round it up 39 miles in total now i know how many miles i can do on one single charge the bike is solid i really do recommend it i wouldn't you like this bike is really good i hope you've enjoyed watching this one people if you have then leave a like on the video down below thanks for watching and i look forward to bringing you another episode very soon take care people peace oh god why do i think these video ideas are a good idea riding an e-bike home with no battery this is a struggle